Hello guys, Bushcraft Family back again, and I want to bring some attention to something that I wasn't going to get involved in and all that. I There's so much fishy stuff going over in Hawaii, Maui, uh, with the fires and whatnot, what the cause is and all that. But there are some people that are involved in this that is using this for profit. And it very much irritated the heck out of me when I watch a billionaire, multiple billionaire, and a almost billionaire, a millionaire. This who I'm talking about is Oprah. Sorry if there's there's people out there that like Oprah. Um, but Oprah and The Rock and the cat's playing over there <laughs> um, are going on live TV telling people that they're going to donate this and that. Um, the thing is Oprah herself could buy everyone a new house over there. She was so concerned about this, but she's asking us, you know, normal folks that are having a hard enough time going day to day to send money. And this People's Fund of Maui, ooh, <laughs> I have done some digging into this, and it's actually not that. Um, the actual, it's what they call EIF, Entertainment Industry Foundation. So-called non-profit, uh, 501, you know. The thing is, this, this, that foundation started off good in the 40s. It was meant to actually help people, not to uh, have investors investing into this company to get a profit off of the, off of people donating. Um, I don't uh, usually I don't talk about you know um, the donations and things because it's not meant. For, for yourself it's to help others and whatnot but when I see these elite people uh, that are well-to-do billionaires begging people that are having a hard enough time surviving for their money I have to say something it's just now I went and done some digging on this EIF, the, this foundation, nonprofit. I keep saying that nonprofit. Um, the people, the CI, CEOs, and all the head guys up there, they're making million dollars a year for running this, you know, foundation, this nonprofit. Nonprofit. They're making millions of dollars they got a they get a salary to work there um which the people who donate pay the pay these people to you know take their money and then they give a percentage of that money to whatever their their cause is at the time and one of them being people's fun of maui now, if I'm going to give money to something, I want to make sure 100% of that money goes to what I'm, I want to help out. I don't want to be paying a CEO or whatever. Even the, the people under them, under those big CEOs, um, those people make hundreds of thousands of dollars a year to do all the work for the you know the higher ups um and so forth and so forth and 
down the line. Um, it's a business. It is not a nonprofit to me. A nonprofit is nobody gets paid. All that money goes to the charity. The people who work there do it um, for charity. They don't get paid anything. That's what my idea of, you know, when you give money, it's it's supposed to be for for what you're giving it to. Now, like I said, I've done, and there's a lot of stuff that I won't talk about on there because it's way, um, like Oprah's already been uh, purchasing land already after the fire why would you do this <laughs> that's people's property that's people's homes they have no choice to sell if they if they want to go live somewhere else that's but yeah <laughs> we won't talk about that stuff anyways um the fact that they, they that there are setting up there acting like they're oh we're gonna give money no you're investing money into a company that's gonna give you a percentage of that money back and you're gonna write it off so where you get that money back anyway oh. and these people haven't been touched by the fire or anything so it's just, it's very irritating. Every time I see it pop up on a news feed or something, I I have to change it because it irritates me so bad. <laughs> but I know there's people out there that want to help these poor people that have been through so much, uh, losing their homes, maybe their family members, um, And right now they are not getting anything. They can get something like seven hundred dollars from the government if they can prove that they own the property. <laughs> yeah, more than likely every all that all that stuff got burned up. How are we gonna prove it? Well, you don't get no money then. So yeah. If you donate money, it can be for anything make sure that it's going for what it's going for um, make sure that there's no percentage of it goes to run the company or the you the nonprofit because by the time the actual people get the money um, it, you could you you could send thousands and thousands of dollars and by the time they get it it's a couple hundred dollars because everybody's got their hand out and they're making this into a profit not you know what it is it's a charity it should be going to people but anyway i just you can do your own research on this and you can actually find out who these people are that run these companies um again this uh entertainment industry uh, foundation was a good thing back in the day in the 40s when they nobody got paid for doing good things um, then they turned it around to where you know people get paid to to run the charity um, the fact being is you have to you really have to do research nowadays to make sure that money is going where it's supposed to be going and not the Hollywood elites little foundation that a lot of them are actually invest investors in this which still makes no sense to me it's supposed to be a charity why is there investors in a charity so they make money off of it? it oh anyways i'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go i just it's just something i had to i had to get out there um sorry if you really like these 
some of these Hollywood people that are involved in this, um, they may have been the good people at one time, but when you take advantage of someone losing their house or losing things and like this, losing family members, and you're making a profit off of it, it's got to stop. Anyways, God bless. Have a wonderful day.